Hello and welcome to a another in my mod review series. In this episode we're going to be looking at what I believe to be the best value mod in Farming Simulator 22 and that's the John Deere Vaders. There are basically two balers. Um, one is a US version and one is a European version. They are nice and cheap and that's why I believe they're the best value. So let's get into it and we'll have a look at it. Obviously you'll find it in balers and you can look at the cost of all the other balers. 57, 84, 99, 160 so this is a square baler and both editions are 12,000 euros, $12,000 each. You have one with yellow tines in the front and that I do believe is the US version. And then you have the well, standard correction, I'm not quite sure to be honest which, which version is which. But then you have one that is just plain green. So the 100 and the 600. One of them is a US version and one of them is a, uh, a European version. It doesn't make much difference. They are exactly the same except for the colouring and the decals. As I said they do square bales. Um, 180 up to 240 ba um, inches in length. So yeah, covers all the spectrums. In the in the mod write-up, it does say capacity 4,000 liters, but the 240 bales are actually 6,400 liters. So reasonable amount of capacity. Maybe that that the um, size of the bales are capacity-wise or little smaller than some of the others perhaps but might be a slight negative but 6400 if you're using the biggest bales the 240 size bales um, not to be scoffed at in my opinion right let's go and get one of them done get the 100 out and we'll just do that with some grass just unfolds normally works at a reasonable pace it doesn't use uh, require a huge amount of horsepower either. Only 115 horses required to pull it. I've got this on a big tractor for this uh, um, review, but it doesn't need to be. It can be done with a a smaller tractor. In particular, these both these baiters are are particularly good for when you're starting out when you don't have a lot of money and you want to bail and you don't want to do round bales i like it i think it is as i've said and i will probably say it many more times one of the best value mods on the market so let's get going yes i think we can get up to 12 miles an hour 10 11 miles an hour as we're bailing so that's reasonable speed and as the other square bailers do it does do a couple of bales before it uh, drops one which is not a real problem because it does a, you can empty out at the end of the once you finish bailing, just go back up again. You can see we're averaging 10 to 11 miles an hour, pretty flat, flat land, I must admit. And 
it just works very very smoothly very very basic basic um, mod what I do like about the mod is that it does um, show wear and tear it's probably not going to be enough um, enough work done to actually show it in this in this review but um, from my use of this implement in other series it does start looking a bit better and I love that it I love the look of that well, there we go so we've got three bales out of that there let's have a quick look at them just standard bales nothing nothing special there we can have a look at the capacities all right let's get back and going to change the balers we'll put the 600 on and we'll do some hay with this one you can just see that they are exactly the same there's no real difference you can also get the baler with just one wheel or with one axle should I say not one wheel with one axle um, when you buying it just select the wide tires and that will give you the same version but instead of a double axle it will give you a single axle right let's get this lower down and going of course we do need to unfold it and it works exactly the same as I said the only real difference is the pickup is yellow as opposed to green on the on the 100 and the decals are different otherwise exactly the same does exactly the same job as well we'll just get these two swaths picked up nice and easy turning circle it does have steering on the back wheels as well Oops. <laughs> wasn't concentrating on what I was doing there <laughs> driver error got nothing to do with the mod <laughs> oh dear uh, trying to get a side view and as per usual if I'm not behind it or behind the wheel in cab I can't drive in a straight line <laughs> I am certainly not the most efficient mod <laughs> right we'll get this unloaded and it looks like we only got two bales of hay out of that which is to be expected given that it is Hey, in any case that is the what I believe to be the best value mod on f in Farming Simulator 22 of course you may have other ideas and if you do just drop us a line in the comments and I'll have a look at them well, everybody's of course entitled to their own opinion so quite happy to have a look at any other mod that one may think is better value than this one but for me it's this one well that's where we're going to end this video thank you so much for watching if you've enjoyed it please like and subscribe and we'll catch you in the next one cheerio